Hey guys, it's Judy. Just a small Dollar Tree haul for you guys. Um, start with the snacks. Of course, Aiden got his crunchy Cheetos. He also ate a Lay's at, in the car. <laughs> and then I saw these snacks, which are new. These are cheese it sandwich crackers. So it's Italian four cheese. There's six packs. So it kind of looks like those, well, sandwich crackers. That kind of looks like they are sandwich crackers. Like, um, so it has six packs, so I'm thinking like, like two, two things in it, kind of, right? So six, 1.48 ounces ounce packs. So, can't wait to try it. I thought that might be cool. And where's the nutrition stuff? Okay. If you want to take a look to see that. And then we also, I also found these Jello Creations Dessert Kit, the um, Oreo Dirt Cups. So it comes with Gummy Creatures, um, Oreo Crumbs, and the Pudding Mix. So it's a mix, I guess you have to add milk. Yeah, just add milk. Cups not included. Oh, I thought they were going to have the little cups, but I guess not. What? So it'll say, it says what you need. Um, six five ounce plastic cups wow it makes six of them <laughs> so it's for like a party or something <laughs> three cups cold milk um, mix two minutes and then layer with the Oreos and then the worms there you go so pretty cool for a dollar right so there's six servings it says so we got that, and then um, Aiden saw this National Geographic science activity pad. I have a feeling we already have this, but he saw it and he couldn't keep his eyes off. He kept flipping through the pages and he put it in the basket. <laughs> and then of course they have all like Valentine's Day stuff, but they also have um, a section of the St. Patrick's Day stuff. So they had cute like mini hats. They had like the hats, the all the four leaf clovers, things like that. But this caught my eye, the buttons. So these are actual buttons, like pin buttons. Um, I don't use them for buttons. I just take this part off and use it as for flair for my scrapbooking. So um, really cute. Lucky Charm, I like that one. And you know, just to spruce up um, the uh, layout or something like this. So, see if I dress them up in green for the day. <laughs> and then um, I picked up more of these purple pens. I really like these. These are by Pentel, and this is medium, and it is purple ink. So that's what it says, violet ink, and um, quick drying. So it's one of those like smooth, like liquid gel pens so um not a ballpoint but a gel pen and it is very smooth it doesn't skip and it says it's quick dry no smear and then they also had uh one in uh, the same brand in black i was gonna get it but i ended up not getting it maybe i should have i was thinking for my husband and he doesn't like black ink he uses blue ink so they did have the pilot uh, which is a great, I used to use Pilot pens all the time, G2, and these are um, proven number one longest writing versus average top gel ink. So this is a premium gel roller. Love the G2s. Sometimes they do leak or, um, what do you call it? Yeah, leak. So I just got, did I get one or two? I might have got two of each. Yeah, I got two just to see if my husband liked it because he does a lot of writing. And um, I got another purple one. And then I picked up more Sharpie. Like, I need Sharpie. I can never find the Sharpies when I need them. Like, I need them to write on Ziploc bags and write on label things. And then, so I keep one in the kitchen um, for that. And then, yeah, a real small haul, guys. And then I needed more elastics. Um, I found these. They had the basic solutions. I didn't get, like, the one that had like, 50 of them or whatever. I got the 15 ones because I wanted more better quality um, 
I had the thin ones, the really thin ones, and they just break all the time in my hair. And then for some reason, I don't know if the length is wrong or what, but I wrap it around, wrap it around. I have a lot of hair, but it's also thin. Um, it's not thick hair, it's just a lot of hair. Um, and so, I don't know. I need to wrap it around and around and around. It's like, I don't know. It just it's, it's like the other ones don't seem like they, like, it's always like one more, I wanna loop it, but I can't. <laughs> that makes sense guys I don't know but this looks like a good size that I can wrap two and it should hold my hair instead of like two and a half or whatever and these are interesting because they have like a texture to it so maybe it'll hold a little better um and it's like two tones so that's kind of cool anyway I ramble and then last but not least oh no I'm getting messed it up the book they had this Bobby Dean book from mama's table to mine so you know I am a sucker for cookbooks so just a little flip through I love cookbooks that show the pictures really nice pictures and just list the ingredients and and I love when they have little blurbs about um either you know their story about it and you know they have little stories um or you know substitutions like this subs and swaps and breaking it down before after like if you want to sub make it a little healthier so you see how you split the fat in half if you serve these red beans on brown rice for you know like things like that so shrimp and sausage things like that so I love that they have that substitution thing mm, chicken fried steak with cream gravy yeah so ooh, yummy 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 so I'm getting hungry because it is almost dinner time and I haven't even started dinner I think I was planning on making baked ziti tonight so anyway they had this what else did they had they had they had um, like new books that I haven't seen before you know there's always some kind of fiction book fiction book that looks interesting and then they also had biographies they had one on the Hiltons the Hilton family and they also it was like this thick they also had one on like the Johnsons and Johnsons or something like that and they had a lot of different ones so definitely keep your eye out but always cookbooks always attract my attention so this was the only cookbook I saw and they had a few of these, so let me know what you guys think of the haul and what you guys have been finding at your Dollar Tree. Um, a lot of um, Valentine's Day stuff and, yeah, decorations and things like that. So, that is that. And I guess that's it, guys. <laughs> Hope you guys are doing well. My hauls are not nearly as big as they used to be. I'm trying to cut back, cut down. But, yeah, but I really haven't found anything in the stores that catch my eye. I did see washi tape, but they were, like, old washi tape that I already have. Probably from, like, six months ago, maybe. Like, back, like, they had the polka dot one and, um, what else? Just, like, patterned ones. Not really the really cute ones that I'm looking for. Um, but that's it. Okay, enough rambling. Hope you guys have a great night. I'm starving. So, um, bye, guys. Bye. Oh, I also did an Aldi haul, but I don't know. It's just a lot of snacks and stuff. I might do it tomorrow, but I put everything away already, so maybe not. So, <laughs> take care, guys. Bye.